Hi everyone! In this video I'm going to give you a quick run through of iMine version 2. iMine is an eye controlled interface that allows gamers to play Minecraft without needing to use a keyboard or mouse. For the new version of iMine we've taken feedback from our users to streamline and optimise their Minecraft experience, adding new features and making improvements to the controls iMine provides an on-screen, gaze-controlled keyboard that sits alongside Minecraft Java Edition giving access to the game. iMine is designed to be played using only an eye tracker or a head mouse, but if you prefer you may also use a switch for key selection in iMine or as a direct control for mining and building. As with the original version of iMine, we support users with a wide range of abilities, whether you need larger targets, or prefer to have everything available in a single advanced keyboard. The new version of iMine has native support for even more eye trackers, as well as any input method that can control the mouse cursor. We've also added a selection of bonus keyboards. In the settings keyboard, an eye gaze user can now adjust the speed they look around the world, or change their walking speed. The mouse and menus keyboard supports menu navigation within Minecraft and also features function keys for advanced Minecraft inventory management. Save toolbars allow you to store and restore your favourite building items, which are visible in the toolbars tab of the inventory. To save your current toolbar, close the inventory, select save followed by the number of the slot you want to save it to. To load another toolbar, select Load, followed by its number. The Builder's keyboard is optimised for players who are building in creative mode, with extra flying options, an iron sights mode for precision tasks, and various options for dwelling. Using the new Dwell to Build functionality is also supported in the Intermediate and Advanced keyboards. Simply turn on Dwell Building and look at the place where you want to place a block. Dwelling directly in the Minecraft world can significantly speed up your building process, while avoiding mistakes caused by aiming errors. As always, there are plenty of options for customising your Minecraft experience, whether you're a complete beginner or an expert user. Within the Minecraft mod config, you can adjust many of the assistive features according to your preference. The iMine keyboard itself is adjustable, and in the settings you can change your eye tracker setup, including dwell or switch control as well as many other options to customise iMind's gaze-controlled keyboard. To find out more and to download and install the latest version of iMind, please visit www.specialeffect.org.uk forward slash iMind. 